Operations is basically about a third of the work that we do as the firm. It's the largest functional practice that we have. It's really the area within the firm where we help our clients actually deliver results in their operations, in their asset intensive industries. There are a number of service lines that we have. The first is capital excellence. The second is service operations. We've also got product development and procurement and manufacturing and supply chain. Operations is really special to me because I get to solve problems that I was on the other end of in my previous career. Uh, and I get to work with people that care about it just as much as I do. Uh, we work hard, but the problems that we're solving are really important to today's world. One of the common misconceptions about McKinsey is that we're a pure strategy consultancy and all we do is do a bunch of research, make a bunch of excels and make a 400 page PowerPoint presentation that just goes in the shredder. What we actually do is you know, partner with our clients from the first step in the improvement process, work out what they should do, and that, that effectively is strategy, but then we'll be with them all the way through the implementation process, and then we help them tackle the next thing. It's not a transactional relationship we have with our clients. It's a partnership that lasts for years and years and years. What makes McKinsey Operation very special to me is the fact that although it's a European-wide practice with you know more than 600 consultants and a lot of staffing opportunities in Europe and even all over the world. Um, yet it still feels like a very small and tight community. The level of support and careness that I got from the operation practice was a key for my personal growth at the firm. For me, operation is mostly about the people, I have to say. So when I say people, I truly think there is a community feeling uh, within McKinsey Operations. We get to meet a lot of people through projects for clients, but also practice development or any other topics. We also do have the occasion to meet and to gather around more fun events. I've started building my community with a specific subgroup, which is like the Women in Operations group, which is, I think, the biggest support network that we have. So it's a group where you can talk about content if, if you need, but it's really also like, how do I make my own McKinsey? How, how do I progress? How do I develop? Who do I talk to? It's just good to have this support, support system. Um, which you may not have everywhere. What surprises me the most at McKinsey Operation is the number of experts that we have on everything really. So for every kind of topic, you will always find someone to jump in and uh, be ready to support either internally or for a client on a very specific expertise. And that truly amazes me every time I'm still confronted to it. As a consultant working at McKinsey, you're really the, the tip of a very big iceberg. You're the person speaking to the clients every day, working out what their problem is and how to solve it, but you've got this massive resource behind you of research specialists, you know, really, really great experts who've worked in the field for 30 years and know the ins and outs of everything. And you've got all that behind you. And that's, it's a real pleasure to be able to bring that all through you as a conduit to the client and, and solve problems like that. So a typical week for me is a week where I spend at least two days on the ground with the clients, meaning co-locating um, at the clients. Uh, with my teams um, and the rest of the time I am either in the Paris office uh, or working from home um, and this gives me a lot of flexibility. I never, I never spend a day without interacting with the clients so we are always connected uh, virtually with the teams as well because this is the best way for all of us also to grow and continue developing but um, this way of working which is hybrid is also a good opportunity for us to create a better balance also. Before I joined McKinsey, I wasn't certain that I would fit in. I'm from Manchester originally. I thought I would feel very left out in the office, that I might be the only northerner here. I couldn't have been more wrong. I found people just like me. I found people from all diverse backgrounds. Everybody supports each other. It's a real community. So the great thing about McKinsey is it's not just intelligent, highly intelligent people. It's different perspectives and people who can learn, people who can adapt. So different backgrounds, different experience, the more diverse the background, actually the better, because the problems we are solving are becoming more and more complex, and we need that variety to think differently. I would say McKinsey is possibly the most unique place that I have ever worked. It is demanding, and it is rewarding in equal measures. There are weeks when things are very quiet. There are weeks when it is incredibly busy, and you end up on a Friday thinking, what happened to the week? but it is the most rewarding and just interesting. The sheer variety of problems, the things that are solved by McKinsey, 
are just incredible. So if you want anything but a mundane life, join McKinsey.